Hey folks, welcome back. Now, as most of you know, I've started a mini claw machine business here in East London. But I've never really shown you exactly where those machines are. So in Shoreditch in East London, where I've got a few of my machines, uh, let me show you around. Plus, just as I was leaving, another delivery from 1688 arrived. So I'll show you a sneaky peek of those toys later on in the video. Full intro. So this is Brick Lane. It's home to some of the best curry houses in all of London. I've been living in London for over 20 years and if you want a good curry, this is the place to go. However, today we are not here for curry. I'm off to go and collect from my pizza location and maybe get some lunch as well because I'm starving. Oh my god, I'm looking forward to this. I am starved. <laughs> See, you just gotta choose your location widely. So you get fed every week. <laughs> That was delicious. Now I've had my means, it's time to get my dessert. And also, collect what I'm at it. I was really obsessed about having headphones in a box. They're just a wee bit too cumbersome and difficult to win. They're slowly going, but Sometimes you make a mistake. I'm not perfect. Hmm? Oh. Touch me. Oh, okay. outside Buzzland. This is a 24-hour booze and convenience shop and one of my first ever locations. It is run by two of the nicest brothers you're ever likely to meet. And it did so well, it got me thinking, maybe these mini marts are actually quite good locations. You've got lots of people coming in and out, spending little bits of money here and there. And with that high turnover and that willingness to just spend 50 pence, one pound, turns out they're more likely to play the machines as well. As such, I've got two more locations on top of this one. And they're just solid owners, every single one of them. Not amazing, but every single week they do at least $70, $80 a week. And that's the minimum. It's a weird find, but you never know with locations, folks. You never know. Let me show you. Do you see what I mean about these headphones? Bad idea, I got it wrong, I admit it. Let, let's move on. There we go, you got to take one of the portions of my route 
the ever so trendy Shoreditch. Just thought you might like to see a bit more in depth as to where I collect from. Plus, I got fed so well, it was delicious. Like I said before, I was literally leaving the door when I got a knock from quite a grumpy delivery man and I soon realised why he was grumpy. Everything I ordered came in one very heavy box. So heavy in fact it was splitting at the seams. I'll give you a wee sneak peek of what arrived. I've not, <laughs> I've not really had a chance to look at them properly. One uh, mini craft day. That's how you pronounce that. <gasps> how cute. The wonderful Natasha from Love for Claw Machines put me onto this. And this one as well. Look. Little ghost fish. Boo. Boo. I actually, these are the two cutest things in the world. Uh, what else? Oh, uh, yes. Potter. I know nothing about Harry Potter. I know that much, though. Potter. Nailed it. Nailed You can't tell me I didn't. I nailed it. <laughs> Folks, I need to look through all of this properly. I've got to count it. I can't even remember half of what I ordered. However, you can watch a toy review later on this week of all of this. The video will probably pop up here. Give it a view and we'll see together if the toys are a yay or a nay. Till next time, just, just, just happy gaming. One uh, mini craft. One mi mini, mini craft. One uh, mini craft day. Eh?